So, if you're asking where the hell did you end up, uh, Alex, uh, why don't you continue doing the morning rant every Monday morning? The reason is that uh, May, June and July for me are very intense months because everything happens before the summer break. Everything has to be finished and I'm working today on three video projects, a TV commercial, a corporate video, and I did a production for the backdrops of a theater show. And uh, meanwhile, I'm working on, on, a, on an app for iOS and Android simultaneously using skip.tools. So the work in progress for this content AI is slowed down a bit. But I want you to assure you that the, the app is almost finished. Yesterday, I did a very big update because I changed the way sentence and uh, question are uh, asked and queried to the database. You know, today I scanned deeply something like a dozen uh, hard drives for a total of something like 15 terabytes for a total of 4 million files, of which half a million, half a million are media files. 500,000 photos, video, audio. It's a huge database, it's a huge amount of data, it's a huge amount of files. Queries are becoming a little slower. You know, if you search for something like Sky in my photo library of this content AI, you will find something like 29,000 photos. 29,000 photos. And then these 29,000 photos must be researched for colors, for resolution, for creation and modification date, and for content. So it's a huge amount of stuff to, to present to the user. And sometimes this query can take something like 10, 12, even 15 seconds. You know, 15 seconds for an app, it's a huge amount of time. It's endless. For a mobile app, it would mean that the app is absolutely meaningless. But for this kind of app, maybe it's not uh, true because this is a very powerful and strong database. And so if you refine the search and search, uh, search for something like the name of the project or the client, or be more specific for the content of the, of the pictures, the, the query is done in a less time. But I, I worked a lot under the hood to increase the performance because, you know, I developed a, a structure, a, a big framework underneath that has only one goal, to reduce the number of queries that you do to the database. And so everything is cached, pre-cached in uh, something like five or six layers of caching because, you know, you can search for a certain keyword or keywords and then the search is cached and then you can search for colors and then this uh, uh, the secondary search is cached and all the photos are grouped in uh, in views because, because there's no infinite scrolling all the views are all the, the search views are paginated 250 um, items by default for images photos and audio and 2500 for a list of files and so the pagination is uh, stacked and uh, pre-fetched and pre-cached too all this to prevent doing the same query twice on the database. And if you're searching for something and then you change the search and then you change the, uh, change the search, only the first and the last search that you're doing are performed and cached to free the, 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 the CPU time and the, 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 the query search time to be more streamlined. I don't think I am the worst case uh, scenario because I think that uh, there are people around all around the world that I will have more files than I do, but I'm an average user, typical user of this app. I think that the performance are quite, quite good. Uh, my beta testers say that uh, now uh, image search is a lightning bolt. <laughs> so I'm quite happy. I didn't have a crash since, uh, I don't know. Uh, today uh, I'm gonna do a new frame, underlying framework for uh, statistics to count the number of files and folders, the number of uh, media files, the number of uh, images, photos, and audio, and the size for video, audio, and, um, and photo files to be displayed, to be more performant and to be more, uh, more easy to use and, and to show to the user. It's almost useless for this kind of app, but it's pleasant to see, and so I want to use this uh, to create a better promotional video. 
that they have to redo from scratch because the interface changed completely. Because now you can you you have the the single search bar and then you specify which kind of search uh, you do files, photo, video, and audio files, just like Google. Okay, and that's it. I think that uh, that's all for today. <laughs> I'm sorry for my uh, lacking of presence uh, on the internet, but maybe you are happy because <laughs> I'm just another noise production entity <laughs> in the in the collapsing world of information. Next time I will say something about uh, WWDC and artificial uh, Apple intelligence. But uh, for today, that's all. And I always say to you, ciao. -ne. Ah, last thing. Please comment below something. <laughs> Even uh, say fanculo. That means fuck you off in Italian. Just to make this video be more engaging or something like this. Ciao.